everyone, it's Megan from Fashionably Thrifty and today I'm going to be showing you my July favorites. Sorry that I sound really nasally and my face is probably going to be a little red. Um, if you can't tell, I am sick, but I wanted to film because I don't have any more videos pre-recorded and I really want to keep on my upload schedule if I can. But enough rambling, let me just get into this and show you my five fashion favorites for the month. I got to talk about jeans again. I cannot believe I'm becoming a jeans girl. Still, trousers are my favorite. I'm wearing my black trousers right now. But jeans, I'm loving jeans and I'm shocked. This is my newest pair of jeans. I got these at a thrift store and probably eventually I'll put them in a thrift haul, but I don't have enough items for a thrift haul yet. But um, I love the wash of these. It's kind of like I don't know what this wash would be because it's not really quite a medium wash, but it's not really like a super light wash. It's kind of like the mid between a light wash and a medium wash. Is that called a mid wash? I don't know. I'm clueless right now. The cool thing is that these are slightly flared at the bottom. It says boot cut in here, but this isn't really what I usually consider boot cut. To me, this is more like a kick flare. I love the length of these. They're just like a tiny bit cropped and I always love cropped pants. And yeah, like I said, these are from the thrift store. These are from the kids section because that's usually where I can find jeans that I know will fit me is if I get one of the bigger sizes in the kids section. So these were originally from Children's Place. Um, but they're like really like a substantial denim. Like they have like no stretch to them like at all. I don't think it has any elastic. Okay, it's 1% spandex, but that's it. So it's like very much like a legit denim jean, which I love. I love like the rigidness of these. Next is a top that I've actually worn with those jeans, and it's been one of my favorite outfits of like the past few months. And so I'll definitely show you in the cutaways with the outfits. But that is my basic black off the shoulder top. I got this like three years ago but like two summers ago this was like the top that I wore day in day out um, which is not usually like me but this was the top I just like couldn't stop wearing I was wearing it all the time so I definitely thought it was like a wardrobe essential for me but then the next summer I think I wore it like once in the whole like spring to summer time period like I just didn't wear it I was gravitating towards other stuff but then this summer my love for it has definitely um, started over again, or not started over again, but I've rediscovered my love for this. Um, yeah, I just love the silhouette of like off the shoulder. I got like the cold shoulder arm right now, but um, yeah, I love the silhouette of off the shoulder. This is my only top though, and it's just a basic black one. This is actually a hand me down. It's originally from No Boundaries, and yeah, just black off the shoulder top. A basic, but I've been loving it. I have one pair of shoes to show you, and I'm like really shocked to be showing these because these were like these used to be like one of the shoes that I wear all the time and then I wasn't wearing them like at all because they're flats and I don't really like wearing flats unless they're like sneakers but these are my one pair of flats that aren't sneakers and they are my black oxfords I hadn't been wearing them like at all but then recently I was just like you know what these are really cute I want to wear them some but I haven't worn them like a bunch but I wore them enough that I really wanted to fe feature them in favorites video especially because I don't have a lot of favorites this month because I went to camp for one whole week and so wore like camp shirts and then I've been sick and so I didn't like change out of my pajamas for quite a while but these were definitely something I was wearing a lot before I went to camp and then have been wearing a couple times afterwards so yeah just basic black oxfords. I feel like I'm showing a lot of basics this month. Next is a kind of category of top. There's only really one that I've really been wearing a lot, but um, I wanted to show both of them. And it's kind of like a weird category to include, but it is Back to the Future tops. Back to the Future is one of my favorite films of all time. And so I had first gotten this top and this is definitely the one I've been wearing quite a bit. You will have seen this in my summer like outfits of the week. Um, I think this is in my last favorites video in an outfit. Yeah, it was. I hadn't worn this in such a long time until one day I just 
wore an outfit with it and then ended up wearing it like five other times in like three weeks or so which is not like me so yeah I just I don't know why I just suddenly rediscovered my love for it I love that it's a ringer tee I love that it's cropped I love the colors of it it's just really really cool this is from Rue 21 and I think I got it like four years ago four or five years ago and then my other one I haven't really worn as much but I still wanted to include it because like I've already shown this in quite a few outfits so I want to do an outfit with this and I have been loving it I wore it a couple times um yeah this one I thrifted I think I included it in my favorite thrift finds but it was like a dollar or two dollars I think it was two dollars um and it's just this gray back to the future shirt I actually like the graphic on this more but I like like the black and white color of this of the shirt rather than the gray but this graphic is so cool but yeah I love both these shirts and I love Back to the Future. My last favorite for this month is something that is definitely not really summery but I don't care. Black pants are definitely a staple in my wardrobe so I have this really cool pair that are these basically they're like black skinny jeans but instead of being denim they are velour and they are so cool um yeah so definitely not really summery because they're velour but I don't care I'm still gonna wear them I love that they add like texture and a point of difference to an outfit um where you usually just have black jeans instead you have velour pants they're so cool these are from dirt cheap I think I got them for eight or nine dollars they're originally from Massimo is that is that what Massimo is is that the Massimo thing I never know I know like the brand but I never know if that's actually Massimo or if that's some other name because I can't read it it's a weird font so that is all for my haul not my haul but that was not a haul that is all for my July favorites video yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I will hopefully see you guys next week with a new video. Bye!